welcome to this um, course, the Comprehensive Critical Care course of the Indian Society of Critical Care Medicine. I am going to talk to you about uh, acute kidney injury. You must remember that uh, multi-system organ failure is the greatest bugbear of all intensive care. And of them, uh, acute kidney injury carries a very high attributable, mo attributable mortality rate. In today's talk, I am going to take you through the definition and classification of M AKI, then discuss a diagnostic approach to a patient who has oligoanuria, and then in brief discuss the management principles of acute kidney injury. Let us start with the case. This is a 32 year old lady, ideal body weight is 60 kg. She is 3 weeks postpartum and she presents with fever, chills and burning maturation of 3 days duration. Her respiratory rate is 28 per minute, oxygen saturation is 92 percent on air, pulse is 126 per minute, blood pressure is 85 by 45 and she has not passed any urine for about 12 hours. So what do you think? Does she have acute kidney injury? Before we diagnose acute kidney injury, we must distinguish between oliguria and urinary retention. And this is best done by percussing the hypogastrium, the pelvic region and seeing if the dull note on percussion indicates a full bladder. An ultrasound examination now available in all ICUs makes it very easy to pick up a distended bladder. If that is so, then catheterize and find out how much the urine is. So, the oliguria is solved by just catheterizing the patient and finding out the urine output. This is a picture of an ultrasound which shows you a full bladder and shows you the capacity. It shows that 160 ml urine is there in the bladder. After catheterization for this patient, 230 ml of urine was drained. So, this can be counted as from 6 o'clock in the morning to 6 o'clock in the evening about 12 hours. So, she has only 230 ml urine in the last 12 hours. Her creatinine is 1.1 milligrams per cent. Her previous creatinine was 0.8 milligrams per deciliter. So, how does one go ahead? What does one make of this? Is this to be called AKI even though the creatinine is normal? 